What's up, Fitness Squad? This is Brad, aka Too Fit It, coming to you with another quick video. And today is the day we're actually moving forward with the bags for the Ultima. So I have the full kit. Everything is here already. Got the tank management, the bags over coilovers, which is the setup I'm going with over the BCs. But right now, about to meet the homie Ryan over at Lowe's, I believe, and we're gonna get some flooring so we can do a nice trunk setup. I know I don't have a lot of space in the trunk, but it should still be enough to have a decent setup. And this will be, I guess you can call it version one for the trunk setup. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look. So yeah, see what I mean? I ain't got a lot of space. Um, the tank probably is gonna be sitting there. Management will be on one side. I'm probably gonna go with two different um, compressors but starting off I'm gonna have just the one um, so I'm not sure what side it's gonna be yet kind of leave that to the masters is gonna be setting everything up um, I thought about putting the tank up here but that might cost some I don't know Do we have clear the shoes eh, I don't know we'll see but definitely gotta replace this I tried to clean it up as you can see and it looks a little better but it definitely ain't where it needs to be so that's gonna be replaced here pretty soon as well as my banner I'm gonna go with a different material for that but yeah that's enough of me running my mouth let's go ahead and meet the homie and look who's here mm -hmm. that's clean seeing a lot of these lately but clean probably not going to record too much due to the audio the music copyright plan all right so I don't know if I am including any clips from when we went into um, Lowe's due to all the music that was playing but um, we are like we, I did get um, a nice uh, flooring uh, which I'll show you here in a minute because it looks like the homie Ryan already got it fitted to the trunk and everything I'm about to head on over there so we can kind of get started with everything but the homies at Petsio has sent me another camera um, for a review. So I'll be doing that here pretty soon. Um, I might start it today. Um, just while everything's going on with the car. I'm not sure if it's going to be enough light for me to really get some good footage. Due to how long it's going to take. But we'll see. So, But definitely stay tuned for that video. Um, that'll be coming soon. But this is the tank. And I got the car loaded up with everything else. So... Man, let's go ahead and head on over there. Alright, so I'll show you that in a second. But, uh, homie showed up. You gonna air out on us? Let's see, is it? Oh, there you go. Had to get it. I feel like I'll be missing it a lot. Soon, soon. <laughs> Alright, here we go. This is it. Let me know what you guys think. Get stuff pulled out. And of course we got Kiwi. Sunbathing over here. <laughs> but yeah. Getting started. Alright. Going to be running the line through there. By the gas line. Oh, All right, you ready? Let's do this cold start. Start it. Be ready. Oh, there you go. Resonator delete. All <laughs> right. It's crazy. All 
all right this is another day uh, it's actually a week later so it turns out I'm not sure if I explained it in a previous clip or not but um, some of the parts weren't in the kit that um, I received so I had to wait for they for them to um, for us to receive it turns out they were back ordered and it just randomly showed up a few days later um, so now next week we're going to go ahead and proceed I did finally switch the camera with my wife so she has the new camera I have her old camera so the base shouldn't be an issue for me any longer so yeah uh, one of the bags was perfect One of them is done. <laughs> Got the three out of four. <laughs> they are definitely killing it. You got a tank. All right, I haven't picked up the camera in a while. Um, it's been quite a headache, uh, but we are looking good. And we are on air, but we are on air on three of the four sides because when we received this one, we didn't notice until we was putting everything in. But, as you can see, there's no place to install the airline. Nowhere. So, this bag did not get drilled properly. Not only that, three out of the four bags had to be re-drilled at the top because they weren't drilled properly on the top, too. So, I went with a company called Airmex for the bags. And that's the issue I had. Uh, one of the homies went with the same company, same bags, but all of his were fine. So I'm reaching out to them to try to figure out what we're going to do about that bag. Um, but yeah, like I said, we got three of the four set up on bags. Um, this is the side that's on a coilover still. The height for that one is okay. Um, Luckily, we had another piece for a coilover just laying around. Um, another coilover, random coilover, that fit. So, we just put that one on, kept the BC spring on it. I think it's Megan racing. Kept the BC spring on it, and then we still got this BC out right now. It's definitely a headache, but uh, we are on air. Can you get the um, drop the back again? See? Boom. So this is where I'll be sitting. Thanks. Uh -huh. But yeah, that's pretty much how it should be. Now it is sitting like right on there. No camera arms or anything. Let's throw some more air in the tank. But yeah, it's pretty responsive. So, um, we could have taken it to a shop to have it drilled and sealed, but I'm gonna try to let them make it up like how it should properly be done. And then um, we'll kind of go from there. I'll keep you guys in the loop. Um, I'll, I'm sure I'll put a teaser up already. But this video is definitely a couple weeks in the making. Um, even though I started receiving parts even before then. But yeah, I can't be riding like that though. Monster truck in the front. 
All right, so this is what we got for the trunk set up for now. Um, I have lights too. We work on getting those connected back. So I'll do the full lit up in a second. Um, got the one compressor. Um, thinking about going with the second one, but so far I think we're good with that one. Um, yeah, I'm happy with the setup so far, other than that one bag issue. But um, I won't have an update in this video, uh, just because this video has been so long trying to make this one. So I'm going to get this one out, but um, maybe the next video will be an update on that. Um, so yeah, step, definitely stay tuned for that. But yeah, let me go ahead and just wait another moment, and um, next clip should be with the trunk on. All right, here we go. I'm probably gonna run this color a lot. And this is gonna be my default, so I can just open the trunk and see in it. Not that there's gonna be anything back here, but yeah. I'm definitely gonna put a decal here, video. I'm gonna put a, a decal here. Probably gonna be too fitted. I'm glad I didn't put it on before I put the tank in because it might have been facing the wrong way. Couldn't see it, but that's what it's gonna be. But yeah, definitely shout out to the homie Ryan and Edwin. Um, I will be putting links to their Instagrams below. So make sure you follow the homies. Um, Ryan did the wiring and the physical stuff. Uh, Edwin did the bags onto the coilovers for the most part and came out pretty well. Boom. Twinkle. But yeah, that's pretty much gonna do it for this video. Um, like I said, we'll once we get the fourth one in, I'll do full air out and all of that stuff uh, for that. But yeah, I'd like to thank you all for sending in. Please like, comment, subscribe, and as always, stay fitted. Peace.